today is October 4 and today is a big day. It's been a month since my uh, egg collection so today is my transfer day. <laughs> So yes guys, it's my uh, pro uh, frozen embryo transfer and after ng aking um, egg collection before, hindi sila nag-transfer sa akin ng embryo because uh, my, my specialist, he preferred to transfer um, frozen embryo compared sa fresh embryo. It's because he said frozen embryo is more successful than uh, fresh embryo. So, naghintay pa ako ng one month kasi kailangan ko mag-ovulate. So, I need to wait my monthly cycle again and mag-ovulate para ma-schedule ang aking uh, embryo transfer. So, kasi meron silang mga specific time talaga or day na kailangan yung perfect day na yon after ng I don't know, basta yun na guys nagaano sila, minomonitor nila yung aking uh, uh, ovulation after ng ov after ko mag ovulate so nag count lang, nag count sila ng 5 days, is it 5 days? 5 days after the ovulation? Yeah. yeah, after my ovulation last month, <laughs> last September nag count sila ng 5 days and then schedule na nila yung aking um, what do you call this? Uh, transfer. Embryo transfer. So, this is it today. is September 4, uh, October 4. It's my embryo transfer. So, hi guys. Dito na kami ngayon sa clinic. But, uh, we are waiting here inside the car. Kasi, 11.20 pa yung aking, ano, aking uh, procedure. Ang aking transfer. So, we will stay here in the car and we already informed them. Na nandito na kami so tatawag sila kung dito na akong papasok kasi yan yung uh, uh, ano nila ngayon dito guys tawag nito yan yung requirement uh, what do you call it? procedure hmm. so we are here ayan naghihintay na lang kami ng tawag para makapasok na ako and before that nung Saturday 48 hours before my, my transfer kailangan ko mag swab test. So, I'm negative now. So, yes. We are here. At yan yung building ng clinic, guys. Which is Linfax House. Ayan. Ayan, mga building yan dyan. And, parang maihi na talaga ako, guys. But, I'm not allowed na umihi 30 minutes before yung aking transfer. Kasi, uh, kailangan full yung bladder ko para Okay, yung, yung position ng uterus kapag uh, mag-transfer na sila ng embryo. So, yeah! <sighs> I feel so nervous, guys. But hopefully, finger cross na... Ay, bakit nagbabasa ko? Finger cross na sana maging okay ang lahat. Sana maging successful. <sighs> October 14, uh, Thursday, ito yung day kung kailan ako mag-PPT na. <laughs> After 10 days ng aking uh, embryo transfer, so this is it na guys. Kailangan ko na mag-pregnancy test. I'm so nervous as in kinakabahan ako. So, magiging result and after ng aking PT, uh, uh, aalis ako, pupunta ako ng uh, blood test. So, whatever the result for my PT, sa pregnancy test ko, uh, mag-undergo pa rin ako ng, um, uh, what do you call this, um, blood test. So, yeah, this is it guys, after 10 days of waiting. So, I have... Actually, iba yung nabili ko na pregnancy test, guys. I have my Clear Blue Pregnancy Test, the Ultra Early. So, ayan. <laughs> Actually, bis, iwan ko bakit ito yung binili ko. But anyway, pwede naman siya daw. Pwede naman daw ito. So, <sighs> kinakabahan ako, guys. Kasi alam mo yung madami kang pinagdaanan. And then, yeah. so this is it. So, wag na natin patagalin, guys. Ah, babalikan ko kayo. Mag-ano muna ako. Oh. 
one eternity later. So, after three minutes, guys, babalikan ko siya. Oh, kinakabahan ako, as in. Hopefully, uh, worth it yung lahat ng sacrifices na ginawa ko, lahat ng pain. So, yes, guys. But this Ilang weeks. So, anyway, we'll say, update ko na lang kayo later. 